So we have here the classic bed of nails physics demonstration. It's to demonstrate the law of inertia. What we have, and it also takes into account pressure. So what we have here for our bed of nails is we have a number of nails set up and there's so many that all of the force is spread out over all of the nail heads. So pressure is equal to force divided by area. So when I lay down on this, there will be less than one newton of force on the top of each of the nail heads, and it won't be enough to break my skin. What we're then going to do is show Newton's first law of inertia, which is an object in motion stays in motion, and an object at rest stays at rest, unless acted on by an unbalanced force. The other part of that is stuff that's massive doesn't like to change what it's doing. That's actually a property of inertia. Inertia is resistance to change. So what we're going to do is I'm going to lay down, we're going to put a board on top of me, and then a cinder block. The cinder block's very heavy it's going to resist change in motion. So we're going to hit that cinder block with a sledgehammer. Part of it, that energy and that force is going to be dissipated as the top of the cinder block breaks. But also it's massive, so it doesn't want to change its position. So I won't feel very much of the force underneath of it. So there won't be much change to me laying on this bed of nails as a result of that. Looks scary, but if we believe in physics, everything works out fine.